Gautama Buddha's actual name was Siddhartha. One day, Siddhartha and his cousin Devadatta were walking in the palace garden with bows and arrows in hand. Suddenly, a bird flew overhead. Seeing this, Devadatta shot the arrow aiming at the bird and the bird fell from the sky. Both of them ran to catch the bird. Siddhartha ran as fast as he could and reached first. He saw that the bird was still alive. Seeing that, he gently took out the arrow from its wing. He plucked all the leaves from the side and crushed them to make a juice, which he used as medicine on the bird. Devadatta, who came behind, said, I shot the arrow at the bird, the bird is mine, give it to me. To that, Siddhartha replied, No, I will not give the bird. If the bird died because of the arrow you shot, then you own it. Now the bird is alive, just injured, so I will not give it to you, it is mine. The two had a terrible argument. In the end, both of them decided to go to the king's court, and all the counselors there argued the merits of the case with each other. The king asked his wise ministers to solve this case. After carefully investigating everything that happened, he said, a life is certain, and whoever tries to save it belongs to them, a life cannot be owned by those who try to destroy it. So they said that the bird belongs to Siddhartha. But Devadatta was still arguing that the verdict was not acceptable. After thinking wisely for a while, the ministers placed the bird in the middle and asked Siddhartha and Devadatta to stand on both sides of the bird a little away from it. The bird, with its wound, leapt and bounded and walked towards Siddhartha. The minister told to whomever the bird goes, it belongs to them, and gave the bird to Siddhartha. Buddha thought that it was right to save that bird, so he fought hard for that reason and was able to save it. In the same way, we should always stand on the side of justice, no matter how hard it is. Hope this video was interesting. Like and subscribe for more.